Geocaching is an activity in which one dork hides a little box or a tub or some other little thing and records its GPS coordinates so that other dorks can find it. We are those other dorks. I'm Sam Osterhout, and we are the Cache Kings. Now, when you geocache, you run up against a lot of really interesting things. Of course, there are muggles, but then there's the forces of nature, difficult terrain, and wild animals, and the spirits of the undead sometimes, right? Anyway, today we're gonna talk about the spirits of the undead. First, I have to go here to Bait and Tackle, one of my favorite bars of all time, to meet the School of Seven Bells. Let's go. School of Seven Bells? Yeah. Whoa. Should we go geocaching? <laughs> yes, let's, let's do, do it. it. The geocache we're doing today is called Great Towers. So this one, it's going to be in Ikea. Now, I, <gasps> it's not in. Are you kidding me? It's not in Ikea, but it's in the it's in like the parking lot. The hint is, as the guard faces the right, back and center, one, two, three, up. Is this that gray guard? That's thing? the. It's like a crane. It's like a ship crane. I think that must be the guard. So maybe back here. The crane's going that way, so we're facing this way. It's got to be back here. Back and center, one, two, three, up. Hey, I think I found it. There what? it is. Where was it? It was right up here. Are you kidding The whole me? time. Wow, look at it. This is, represents all of the ghosts of people who have been here. Thanks for sticking this one out. Yeah, that was, that was tough. It was a challenge. One, two, three. So we're heading today to the living room, which is one of the most popular music venues in Manhattan. My girlfriend calls me the Admiral. I can feel this like smell of fear hormones <laughs> in the air from the crew. I think I'm getting really like nervous now. I never knew you had a tattoo. This is where that giant gun battle was in 1903. Without analogy, is like some kind of. Uh, urine scent. Yes! Which is hard to do in the Lower East Side because everything smells like urine. Yeah. Okay, so we're getting close to the geocache. Well, I watched you dance around. It's in here. It's moving around. <laughs> I give up quickly. Okay, okay. I'm not very persistent. Yeah, we got held by some guy once who thought we were digging through his trash. We were digging through his trash. But why did he want his trash so badly that he called the police on us? We take the time to meet the interesting people who help us along in our quest. This makes me look uh, awesome. tough. Hey, who wants to fight? Right. Who wants to wrestle? No, I think I would get in a lot of fights in this house. <laughs> yeah. Open your heart to love and open your pants to sex. Right now? What's in these things? Well, usually it's it's junk, really. I mean, there's a guitar pick, there's an eraser, there's a, a Hot Wheels car. You know, it's not about what's in the cache. It's about finding the cache. It's about the journey, really. Um, Hot Wheels are cool, too, though. I won't lie. Oh, someone hasn't been here in uh, quite a few days. Huh? We found it. I can't believe we found it. Not quite the treasure of the Sierra Madre, but it's but there's a sense of achievement. Some may ask, what is the point of it? Running around the city looking for pieces of Tupperware? Why would you want to do that? And we say, why would you want to do that? 